Hey everybody, it's once again time to clear off some of this water lettuce back over here so I can actually feed my turtles. You can see it has absolutely no problem taking over. So let's go ahead and clear some of that out, shall we? All right, I got my handy dandy pool net. I was gonna do a whole full length video on this, but I gotta feed these guys. Oh yeah, look at that. Dump it out. Gotta make sure there's no fishies in here. I see some fishies in there though now. They're like, hey, what is all this light? What is this? I also have some water hyacinth in there. We're for sure gonna leave that in though. And there's a fish. They're starting to make an appearance. Oh yeah, they, they're hungry, they're ready. They're ready. Look at the roots on these guys. Okay, hey, let's get another net out. Let's get another net out. Oh boy. That's actually pretty dang heavy. That's actually pretty gosh dang heavy. I hate doing this because I love these plants so much. Especially these big guys. I would, I used to just pick, pick out the little ones. It's a point in time where I got to come in here and really get them out. Look how beautiful these goldfish are in here. These are just your common goldfish. Oh, I definitely got one in the net that time. Get out of here. Get out of here. I can feel them wriggling in the net. We got them out though. We got them out. Here we go. You need a closer view of these guys. Oh yeah. Awesome. Just gonna clear out a little, little feeding hole. A little feeding hole. You know, we got a decent little hole here. It's getting kind of late in the afternoon. But I think that actually worked out well because now we're not dealing with as bad of a glare. Look at those. So there's four turtles in here as well. They might be spooked by that. They were just sunning right over here. Got some nice calla lilies growing in here. Got my monstera growing in here. Got some... Uh, Butterfly, um, how am I blanking on the name right now? Milky butterfly weed plant thing. I also have some peppermint growing right here and some mums. Let me show you guys something. On my waterfall over here, I have the coolest algae growing. Look at that. Look at the texture of that algae. Also got duckweed up top here. It doesn't survive down in the pond because the goldfish eat it. Oh yeah, that's cool. Feels really nice too. It's my little, so this is an old sump that I repurposed as a waterfall basin. Well, yeah, this is a pond here. I love this pond, it's so relaxing. Sound of the water in the background. Let's throw some food in and see if we can't get these turtles to come out. I just feed this. They seem to love it. The goldfish eat it too. So that's perfect. Throw a handful of food in. See if we can't get anybody to come up. Then we'll get the goldfish up here. Yeah, these goldfish, I bought these when they were like 10 cents or whatever. With little tiny babies. Probably bought about 20 or 30 of them. And these are the ones that the turtles never ate. And they've been doing just, just fine. Get you guys as close of a view as possible here. Oh, you can see a turtle coming up. You can see the red ear. He's coming up right now. He's coming up right now. There he goes. What's up, dude? This water lettuce has been growing so thick. I haven't fed these guys for probably about half a week now. Probably about four or five days. They're fine though. I'd throw some in, but I don't think really much food got to them because there was so much of that water lettuce covering the surface. Where's your buddies at? Look at the colors on these goldfish.
Yeah, I'm glad I waited till later in the day because now we're not dealing with as much glare. Come on, dude, eat. Come on, now. I'm really hoping my phone doesn't fall in here. Oh, I might have scared him. You know, we got some babies too that have, see the baby goldfish down there with the orange on its side? So they, the goldfish have been breeding in here. I'm pretty happy. There's a red ear again. You see him lurking. See him lurk. Oh, here's one of the yellows. One of the yellow bellies. What's up, bro? They probably want a hot dog treat. I'll give them hot dogs every now and then. They love it. Yeah, see, they're looking at me. They're like, yeah, this little food's fine. Where's the hot dogs at? I'll give them hot dogs probably once every like four months. They love it. I'll also give them uh, tilapia and so forth. And little treats. Little treats. Come on, dude. Let's see how close we can get before he gets spooked. Pretty dang close. Yeah, this is the turtle and goldfish pond that has been overtaken by the water lettuce. So I'll do a full video coming out pretty soon on this. We'll get this. We'll get most of this water lettuce cleared off. I don't need this much on here. It's just a bit too much. Oh, here he comes. There he is, he's right behind the food right there. Yeah, you know, just wanna give you guys a little sneak peek at the turtle pond. It's been a while since I've shown this, so. Was this another yellow? There's another yellow hiding right behind the spider plant. There he is. Yeah, they're starting to make their appearance now. You gonna eat? There you go, he took a bite. These guys are pretty big too. Probably almost uh, a foot long. You see, they're not super interested in the goldfish. They're just doing their thing. I put a Mississippi map turtle in here too, but I haven't seen them. <laughs> You know, with the water lettuce the way it is, how, how am I going to see anything? All right, y'all, that's going to wrap it up for tonight. Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you in the next video. See ya.